Hello everyone. Welcome to Tiwi World Channel. On this video today, we will learn to pray and destroy the plants of unfriendly friend around you. There are powerful prayers with scriptural backings in this video. I encourage you to watch to the end. Don't forget that there are always unfriendly friend around us. Please subscribe, like, comment and share. God bless you. Good morning. You didn't inform me that you would be coming this morning. Do you imply I should go to CNN before I come to see my son? That is not what I mean. Where is my son? He left for work. Go and bring my stuff from the car. All right, Ma. I didn't know you were around. Now you know. I came to pick Mum's bag from the car. I didn't realize you were coming with her. Now you know. How are you, Becky? I am fine. It's written all over me. Don't leave my bags behind. Make sure you carry all the bags inside. You can carry your bags while I carry Mum's bag. What is your problem, Vicky? I am your sister-in-law, and you will take my order. Fine. I will carry the bags. Nonsense. There are fragile things in my bags, so handle them with care. Where is my brother? He left for work already. You disgust me, Vicky. I am out of here. That witch must leave this house. We have to look for a strategy. What should we do, Mom? We have to be smart. We cannot both be harsh on her. Here is the strategy. You will pretend as if you are now friends with her. When it's time we will strike and chase her out of this house. I can't be friends with Vicky, I don't like her. This is the plan and you must go with the plan. Are you not seeing that your brother no longer has time for us since he married that girl? I will try. Go and make friends with your sister-in-law. What are you doing? I am making breakfast for everyone. I am almost done, food will soon be ready. Can we talk? I hope there is no problem. There is no problem, Vicky, I just want to address something. Go ahead, Becky. I want us to stop being cats and rats. I want this rift between the two of us to end. I want all this fighting to stop. I have never had any problem with you since I got married to your brother. It is you that has always been on my case. I am your friend and I want it to be that way but you will not allow me. I apologize for all my wrongs. I am asking you officially now, can we be friends? Like sister's goal. Sure. Sure. That is how it's supposed to be. Thank you so much. Are we good now? Yes, we are. Thank you, Vicky. Thank you, Becky. How did it go? That girl is so annoying. I have always loved you but it's you that don't want to be my friend. She loves spilling rubbish. We are now friends, according to the plan anyway. Make sure you get all the information, I mean everything going on in her life. I will try. I don't want you to try, I want you to carry out your assignment. I have heard you, Mom. I despise that girl so much. Becky is now a changed person, I am so happy we can connect again. I hope my mother-in-law will turn out to be nice to me. I am happy this is happening now. Welcome son. Good evening mom. I was not expecting you. You didn't tell me you would be coming. We wanted to surprise you. We. I don't understand. I am here with Becky. So, Becky could not call me that you would be coming around. I do not understand you, Williams. Do I have to inform you before I visit my only son? Is this your wife's handwork? 
Leave my wife out of this. Mom. You will go back home tonight with Becky. I didn't inform my wife you will be coming. That does not make me a responsible man. Are you sending me out of your house? I had a long day at work, Mom. I am going to my room. You are talking to me the way you like because of that thing you call a wife. She must leave this house by force. I know you are not in your right sense because it is obvious that the girl is using something on you. How is work today, babe? It was fine. Are you all right? I met mom in the living room now. She didn't tell me she will be coming. She came with Becky. But it's fine. They must go back home this night. Both mom and Vicky are a handful. I know how they can be when they are around you. Please, don't send them home. Becky and I are now friends. You won't believe if I told you that she apologized to me this morning. We are now in good terms. Are you sure of what you are saying? Yes, I am. Although mom and I are not getting along, for Becky that is a milestone. I know soon mom will come around. Do you want them to stay? Yes. If that is what you want, it's fine. Thank you, babe. What did the priestess say? We have to find a way to put this portion in her food. She will start misbehaving. The priestess said one of the things she would start doing is sleeping with different men. My brother hates it when a woman is promiscuous. The priestess said her misbehavior would be out of control. I can't wait for that thing to leave this house. How would this portion get into her food? Tomorrow I will look for a way to get this sorted. I know you are smart like me. I am my mother's daughter. Why are you up at this time, babe? I was waiting for you. I want us to pray. I just felt it in my spirit that we should pray. All right, babe. Let us pray. Thank you, Jesus, because we know that any time we pray you answer us. Thank you, Jesus. Proverbs chapter 26 verse 27 Hoso digeth a pit shall fall therein, and he that rolleth a stone, it will return upon him. Is anyone digging a pit for me or my husband to fall in and let them fall into that pit like Haman did in Jesus' name? Amen. Amen. Isaiah chapter 8 verse 9 Associate yourselves, O ye people, and ye shall be broken in pieces. And give ear, all ye of far countries, gird yourselves, and ye shall be broken in pieces. Gird yourselves, and ye shall be broken in pieces. Isaiah chapter 8 verse 10 Take counsel together, and it shall come to naught. Speak the word, and it shall not stand, for God is with us. Isaiah chapter 7 verse 7 It shall not stand, neither shall it come to pass. Every counsel against my life and my husband, it shall turn to naught in Jesus' name. Jeremiah chapter 30 verse 16 Therefore all they that devour thee shall be devoured. And all thine adversaries, every one of them, shall go into captivity. And they that spoil thee shall be a spoil and all that prey upon thee will I give for a prey. Amen. Amen. Psalm 35 verse 1 Plead my cause, O Lord, with them that strive with me, fight against them that fight against me. Lord Jesus, fight against them that fight against us in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Psalm 35 verse 4 Let them be confounded and put to shame that seeks after my soul. Let them be turned back and brought to confusion that devises my hurt. Anyone planning evil against us, let them be put to shame in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Psalm 7 verse 9 Oh let the wickedness of the wicked come to, an end. But establish the just, for the righteous God trieth the hearts and reigns. Let the wickedness of the wicked come to an end over our lives in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Let their evil fall on them in Jesus' name. Thank you Jesus for answered prayers. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. I love it when we pray together. Guess what, babe? What? Becky is taking me for a treat tomorrow. Wow! Now I know she's serious about what she said. 
I told you she mean every word. I am excited about this. Are you ready? I am good, Mom. Be careful no mistakes. Don't mistakenly eat the wrong food. Everything is in control, Mom. Vicky, I am outside waiting for you. <coughs> what happened? Get up. Get up. Mom. Mom. Where is my daughter? Her leg was completely broken, and we had to do surgery immediately. I have not seen such a case before. What have I done to deserve this? <laughs>